In God's word, before any major move of God, people were killing babies. What Planned Parenthood is doing is barbaric. Those who think they have the right to decide what to do with their own bodies are wrong. The laws are contradictory. In many states, if you're addicted to drugs or alcohol and give birth to an addicted baby, you could go to jail. However, if you abort that baby, you have not broken the law. You can't have it both ways. Do you have the right to kill yourself? In most states, you do not. So how can anyone use the argument they have the right to decide about their own body? If you have a conjoined twin, do you have the right to kill your conjoined twin because you think that person is infringing upon your body? You have the moral decision and right whether or not to spread your legs and get yourself pregnant, but not the moral right to kill another human being. And now knowing that your baby's body parts are going to be sold by homicidal sociopathic monsters, the whole Planned Parenthood organization's only goal is callously profiting themselves, as you can see in this clip. It is completely offensive, horrific, and disgusting. And as taxpayers, we are paying for this. How can any of us who call themselves a follower of Jesus Christ sit idly by and do nothing? Stand up. Say something. Stand up for what is right. Speak out. Well, just listen. This is worse than any horror movie you could watch because this is real. Buddy, there are new developments now in the controversy surrounding Planned Parenthood. A brand new second undercover video now being made public for the first time. And this is the first time we have seen it. Allegedly showing an executive for the group haggling over the price of aborted body parts. This follows a story that broke late last week. Good morning. I'm Bill Hemmer. Welcome here. It's a Tuesday in America's yes, Newsroom. Good morning, Good to be back, Good with, to you, be back with you as well. Mm -hmm. Good morning, everybody. I'm Martha McCallum. So this video that we're talking about was secretly recorded by a pro-life group, and it comes just days after the other video that we showed you last week of the group's medical research director talking over wine and salad about saving valuable organs from aborted fetuses. Of course, that practice of selling tissue from fetuses is illegal. Peter Ducey is live in Washington on this. So, Peter, what does this new video show? Martha, it shows a negotiation about the price of tissue from these aborted fetuses. And when they're talking about how much it should cost, this doctor who is shown says that she wants enough so that she can buy herself a Lamborghini while she's laughing at the end of this conversation. Listen to this. What would you expect for intact um, tissue? What, what sort of compensation? What sort of... Well, why don't you start by telling me what you used to pay? Okay. I don't think so. I, I'd like to, I would like to know what would make you happy. What would work for you? You know, in negotiations, a person who throws up the figure first is at a loss, right? So, <laughs> you, no, I, I don't look at it that way. I know you want to play that game. I get I it, but I no, no, I want. Global. Father Frank Pavone with Priests for Life said about Planned Parenthood this morning that quote, in the light of what they do to kill children and sell their parts, it is clearly immoral to give any support or transact any business with Planned Parenthood. The clip released this morning is set at a restaurant, and this doctor even ties the price of tissue to the volume of abortions, first term versus second term, $50 up to $150 for tissue in between glances at the menu. Martha. Boy, it is unbelievable. So how is Planned Parenthood justifying the conversation that we just saw and heard, Peter? Martha, Planned Parenthood has said they do not sell tissue for profit, and now they are accusing the undercover activists with the Center for Medical Progress of fraud in a statement that they put out preemptively, expecting a possible flood of more bad publicity. Planned Parenthood says this, quote, it appears that the only people who have broken laws are the extremists who have been hounding women and doctors for years. Planned Parenthood accuses the, these activists of illegally recording their employees, of misrepresenting themselves, and of deceptively editing clips to make the health care provider look bad. Martha. We will see. Peter, thank you.